Now, this Thanksgiving, U.S. Airlines airports they're preparing for a surge in passengers with air travel expected to hit its highest in three years. But when it comes to Thanksgiving dinner, there could be a damper. A new survey suggests this year the cost of Thanksgiving dinner will be up by 20%. Our correspondent Susan Tehrani gets you all the details. Take a look. Spending time with family and friends at Thanksgiving remains important for many Americans. And this year, the cost of the meal is also top of mind. Uh, a lot of changes. The, uh, you know, the group size has gotten a lot smaller, um, you know, due to the price of the turkeys, the food, you know, everything is just it's just way too expensive. So we had to cut down on a lot and had to invite a lot less people. Thanksgiving dinner has become 20% more expensive over the past year. <laughs> Rosalind Dickens, who co-owns a turkey farm, says even her longtime customers are thinking twice before making a purchase this year. The prices of the turkeys are astronomical. I'm embarrassed to tell people, but there's no way around it. According to Farm Bureau's 37th annual survey, the average cost to feed 10 people this Thanksgiving is $64.05, which is $10.74 more than last year. The survey conducted by over 200 volunteer shoppers who checked prices in person and online across the country proved that the holiday dinner is anything but inflation proof. As for some good news, well, not everything on the Thanksgiving shopping list is significantly more expensive. Cranberries, for example, had a good harvest year and were less than 5% more expensive from early September to early November this year. Lower production and higher costs for labor, transportation and items are part of the reason for high prices. Analysts say rough weather and the war in Ukraine are also contributors. Susan Tehrani reporting from New York for Weon, World is One. Weon is now available in your country. Download the app now, get all the news on the move.